Well, if you drive a car, you know gas prices are on the way down. It's been nice, right? And that means more money in your pocket, of course. But why are prices falling and why now? WLWT News 5 investigative reporter Todd Dykes is here with a look behind the numbers for us tonight. Hi, Todd. Hi, Sheree. You know, it's all about the barrel. Most of us probably don't pay any attention at all to the sale price of a barrel of benchmark U.S. crude. All most of us care about are low prices at the pump, and that's what drivers are seeing all around the tri state. Filling up for 227 at this Shell station on Delhi Road is just fine with drivers like Ed Augustine. It is a good thing. I uh, just hope it keeps up. I keep hearing it will. We'll have to wait and see. Good news, Ed. Dr. Jamal Rashid, the dean of the School of Business at Mount St. Joseph University, says low prices are here to stay for now. I would not be surprised to, 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 to see a continuation of oil decrease over the next five months. Rashid says, don't worry about the global economy taking a hit. He sees it this way. I think this is a gift from God that came to the U.S. economy. Consumers right now, they have enough, say, enough, enough, enough money to spend on other goods and services. Back at the pump, Eli Ezro of Delhi says the timing couldn't be better. That's really great, especially this time of year with the holiday season and everything. Uh, it's tremendous. Uh, don't understand why it, it jumps, fluctuates so daggone much. One of the key reasons prices are heading south, says Dr. Rashid, is OPEC's decision to keep production rates steady. OPEC's production of barrels of oil combined with less demand means the price of those barrels is falling and it all trickles down to you. Uh, OPEC will not cut uh, production. This is, this is the, I, this, I'm certain about that one because OPEC right now, every single country in OPEC, they are worried about market share. So, thanks to market share and the price of a barrel of oil, you'll have more cash in your pocket, at least for the foreseeable future. Well, the price of a barrel of oil is now around $55, and in June, that same barrel of crude cost $107. That means oil is now at its lowest level since the spring of 2009. Reporting live tonight, Todd Dykes, WWT News 5. Oh, all good news, Todd. Thank you. And for Ohio drivers, the news continues to get better here. AAA says statewide the average cost of a gallon of gas is now $2.41. That's down 19 cents from just one week ago. So